Hi and welcome to the first of our source related videos. This one will quickly show you around the main source slash vendor settings page and explain which tools you can use there and the next video will go into more detail on the numerous options and features you can choose from for each source. So on this page you can set up your sources to keep track of where your leads come from. The sources are divided by lead type on the left and at the top you have the add new source button which we'll talk about later. Then there's update default values which enables you to define which options will be preset when you create a new source. So for example, each new source will now be set up as not active. So now when we click add new, we can see it's preset to be inactive. This feature also gives you the ability to update all sources at once with the checked off default value. So for example, checking off the is active box as well as the yes option next to it will make all existing sources active. This can come in handy if you have a lot of sources and you need to make the same change to all of them. The next is the update lead type box which lists a number of advanced matching options and then there's uh, show or hide hidden sources. This button enables you to manage the visibility of hidden sources. Sources can be set to hidden individually which prevents them from being visible in your partner's filter sets and here you can hide them from the source overview page as well. The last button at the top lets you set up a list of allowed or blocked IPs for all sources. Then in the tools column you can update or copy each source and add or remove it from the filter sets of individual partners that buy leads of that lead type. Then you can also view the history of changes made to this source and there's also a couple of icons to quickly add or remove the source from all partners or all active partners which means that you don't have to add a new source to each partner's filter set manually you can just click this icon and all partners will be able to receive leads from it. Finally this page also gives you access to one-click activation and deactivation of individual sources as well as a quick overview of current source settings on the uh, plus sign on the far left.